Dude, I'm so stoked right now. I've been waiting so long for this and uh, I really didn't know how this was gonna turn out. And finally, I have my wheels. Uh, these are SSR gel buzz, 14 by nine B type in the front, 14 by 10 A type in the back. These were uh, built by Root Bike Custom. I dropped these off to him a while ago and did some custom advertising and redid the faces, did Cerakote on the centers. Then I picked up some brand new center caps from uh, Pine Engineering. Yeah, I'm stoked. These turned out so good, man. Last video we mentioned that we have a big drop coming soon with a bunch of stuff we got jackets seats steering wheels shift knobs lights cup holders all that fun stuff so make sure to stay tuned for that anyways let's go pack these up in the daily uh we'll go meet up with reed and cruise out to his place and hopefully help our homie out one of our homies just put chaos on his r34 Hair looks nice today. Looks beautiful. Yeah? Huh. You want to show everyone your, your new whip? Dude, this is the best car in the world. And I actually got you a little gift that's inside here. What the hell is that? Yeah, there you go, man. That's for you. Four Racing, Goodyear, Viagra, Pfizer. He's got a mother of three now. Yeah, I know. It's just my dad's car, you know? This is the best car money can buy. Do I look handsome yet? I always look handsome. Tyler's going to bring his car over. We're going to put process in it. I'm uh, gonna try and put tires on Dylan's jail bus. Oh yeah, Tyler had all his stuff stolen. So we figured we'd help him out, get him some suspension for his car so he doesn't ride like hell. Cause he's part of the Rough Riders crew right now. <laughs> <laughs> It's my 1984 X6 Cressida, but it's not done yet. Just bought all the body body stuff for it. Um, primer, sandpaper, Bondo, everything. Just to kind of strip down the car and redo everything. Um, a bunch of tools, uh, parts from Japan, luckily. But came out one morning to uh, load up all the parts, come start all the bodywork prep, and the garage door is open and everything is gone, including like, I don't know, I had a bunch of camping gear stolen. Um, I had a shoebox full of stickers from the last maybe five six years of car stuff different events and uh stuff from the homies that was it was pretty sweet luckily i got a pretty cool crew of people around me that helped help chip in and uh, replace a bunch of stuff sick Thank man you, Dylan. yeah no problem man <laughs> yeah. I, I guess that probably puts a bit of a damper on suspension stuff hey yeah a little bit we're gonna put process on this thing no way yeah dude yeah, we also have Max Pinger on T7 coilovers coming for you. Oh, you guys are the greatest. Dude, no problem. I, I literally don't know what to say. <laughs> yeah. Man, we just got the best people in this community, huh? I mean, I the don't best. know. You're, wow. too, you're too enthusiastic about this shit. Don't want to let some thieves, like, knock you out of the game, so. I appreciate it a ton, boys. Thank yeah. you. We're gonna go get Korean fried chicken first because we're really hungry. Yeah, we're gonna take Reed's Laurel. excited to have a real car again. <laughs> Dude, I know that life, man. It was not fun for that like one month I did that. This thing's been like this for a year and a half, so it'll be a really nice, uh, really refreshing feel. How yeah, fucking exploded that is. <laughs> <laughs> we could take it off the rest of the way probably without even taking it straight out. Oh, it's still good.
<laughs> Dude. That's, that's your bump stop, buddy. How come Checkpoint Japan isn't on here? How many subs do you guys got? Uh, I don't know, like 70,000. What color do you think they're gonna be? Blue. Blue? Oh, gray. No, I think they're T, oh, these might be the T7s. Yeah, it's really slick. I like how they went matte with the black. Dude, these are actually, yeah, quite a bit nicer. Seven V2. This is like the updated version of what we did on your car. I do not have brakes. Dude, it's ten times the car it was. Sick. Beyond hype. Hell oh yeah, man. Well, I did. Man, it's, it's the car that I dreamed of driving, but then drove it with no sus and was like, ah. I'm glad that you got to actually enjoy your car now. But now to drive it and not be in constant back pain is going to be really, really great. You know, you can take it for more than an hour long cruise without having to get up to stand and stretch, you know? <laughs> yeah, fully. Yeah. Will. Thank you so much, you guys. Shout out to Max Beating Rod. They make a really great product. And for the price, like, it's, it's unbeatable. They hooked it up. They really, really came through. You did it. We did it. went on the best. I had good help. Uh, everything went on first try. Sweet. Yeah, it looks good. That's the rear. Yeah, that's good. Can't wait to hear the comments of what people think about these. You, that tire's not meant for that wheel. So it's 165, 60, 14 on 14 by nine and 175, 60 on 14 by 10. Looks good, works good. Uh, so yeah, today we're putting different wheels on. It's been a cool like muscle car look, but uh, I've never like had this car at an event specifically for having this car at an event. It's just been like what I've taken or something. Going, driving it up to after hours uh, this weekend and I kind of figured maybe do a new look for it because it's like the only car I'm bringing this time. Yeah, we've got uh, Keith's Mark III's going on it. Uh, 9J, 10J and we'll see how they, uh, how they fit. Fits pretty decent though. Fits good, yeah. Fits great. Um, yeah, there's like a lot of seam sealer in there, so I don't know if I can just scrape it out and and uh, it's good to go, or if there's gonna be metal behind there or what. So we'll see.
thank you guys for watching the video. I know it was a little bit of a shorter one this week, but um, I just want to say I'm stoked that we can help people out. We're in a position with Checkpoint where we have great sponsors, doing pretty well for ourselves. So it feels good to be able to help someone out. And um, yeah, no, I'm stoked. Shout out to Rude Boy for collaborating on helping Tyler out with the process and the install and all that stuff. So yeah, it felt really good. He was stoked. And uh, shout out to Max Beating Rods for the T7 coilovers. Yeah, he was really stoked on them and he said they felt really good. So if you're in the market for an aftermarket affordable coilover, go check out Max Beating Rods. We have a link in our description for 10% off Max Beating Rod coilovers. Uh, they're a pretty wonderful sponsor to us. Yeah, and then shout out to Rude Boy for finishing my wheels. That's like the next key part of the uh, super build. So that'll be coming up soon. Yeah, in the next episode, we're gonna be going out to Kelowna. Our friends from After Hours had a little event in Kelowna. If you're a first time watcher, please go check out our other videos. We have a ton of them. Uh, we usually try to make them every week if we have time. Um, yeah, thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Boom.